My name is Trevor Etienne, and my film is A Woman Scorned. Um, I make this film because I think that I want to show that women have the same type of thoughts as men. If a woman feels betrayal, then she will try to seek revenge in her mind, even if she doesn't go and do it outside of herself, externally, she will think about ways of how she can get revenge. And I think in my story, uh, a woman lies next to her, her husband, knowing that he sleeps with her best friend. And she has seen them making love in her bed. So we start the film when she is in bed with him, knowing this. And it's what goes on in her mind while he sleeps. Sometimes when you are in extreme pain, you internalize everything and you create self-damage to yourself because you won't externalize or tell people what you feel. And I try to play around with this idea of psychological pain and what it does to uh, this particular woman's mind while she goes through this very torturous night um, with a twist at the end of the movie where you realize that all the time she's thinking about how she will get revenge with him, she has already got revenge with the friend. <laughs> and this too is what keeps her mind alive at night because she has already disposed of the friend and now she tries to think of how she disposes of the man. So in a sense, she has become a murderess, but we as the audience don't know this until right at the end of the movie. She's just a murderess in her mind. I like to play around with this um, idea of the mind, because I think the mind and the heart, they don't always work together. And sometimes the heart is always true, but the mind plays tricks. And the mind sometimes is about controlling the heart. So the idea is that if you can somehow break from the mind and the heart and create an energy that is dealing with the emotion of how the mind feels and how the heart feels, then I think visually you can tell different stories. It has it has very mixed reaction. People, women say they love the movie because I give them ideas. Men say don't show no women the movie because <laughs> it gives them too many ideas. But I believe that we are all men and women. And sometimes we just don't know where to find the balance in ourselves. And society says if we are men, we must believe in a particular type of belief which is historic and traditional and cultural and is man-made. And if you're a woman, you must be the matriarch and the mother and the surrenderer. And I believe that we are both as human. So men are women and women are men. And even if we biologically cannot have children, we can biologically take care of them <laughs> in our everyday life. So this opinion sometimes creates conflict with me, <laughs> but that's okay because it is all material for my movies. <laughs> <laughs>